So hey guys, if you guys would like to see how I got this look, then stay tuned for the next portion of the video. And I will see you guys at the end of the video. I will show you guys the back. I really like this texture. This is a 5x5, five five, so the closure stops from here to here. It does come in 6x6, six six, so that's even bigger from here to here, and it actually goes a little bit further back. Um, the 5x5 five five ends right... Oh, I can't even tell. Right here. So here we go. But yeah.
me show you guys how I just install my um, 5x5 closure wig is very simple once um I do use HD laces on um, my closure you can decide if you want to get one made you can choose from transparent or HD I like the HD because it blends is the easier one to actually either or is good HD is very thin so um, it may not last as long as or it just takes extra um, care you have to be very careful with it so that's why I tend not to glue down my HD laces but the transparent one is a little bit more sturdier and gives you the same effect once it's plucked um, to your desire they are pre plucked but just to um, customize a little bit more I do pre I do pluck it a little bit more um so as you can see, I did my makeup already. I'm going to put on my lipstick on camera because usually people ask about that. I do. I use the brand Jamma Face for my brown, my staple brown. I do actually. I mix a lot of um colors together. I have my Color Pop for my highlight in the middle. Gonna be removing the band, and you guys are gonna see. This is what it looks like when it comes. It usually comes out of the band. It looks messy right now, but that's okay because we don't want it to be perfect. I don't usually actually do a lot of baby hairs. Actually, just like. basically just set it just for it to get the mold and for it to go for the baby hairs to lay where you want them but I don't like it the crisp look as you can see and I'm gonna be pulling and you can see it's a little bit so I would probably spray that down but you can see over here like it's really intact and that's only just with the spray very simple I do have the got to be I can use the got to be gel I can use the got to be spray it doesn't matter what I use um, well it does matter what I use I just make sure the adhesives that I use are strong enough so the got to be but it is not sweat proof obviously so and I'm, I'm a sweater that's why I usually don't tack down my um, my laces is because I sweat so it's gonna come off by the end of the night anyways and I don't want it I don't want to feel like it's on. I don't want to know that it's on, but then it's really like shifting back. So I'd rather just use the um, uh, the glueless method and even like the gelless method and just tack on my wig. I have my wig band underneath to keep it intact so it doesn't slip back. So I have a little bit. Just want you guys to see up close. Um. For, I did have to tint my lace. I make my own lace tint using um, um the semi-permanent color. I will have a whole video on that if you guys would like to see a video on how I tint my laces or me actually showing you guys um, me tinting my laces or what I use to tint my laces. Uh, leave a comment below. Like this video. I can just tap whatever's left on my brush. Hmm. 
go. And there you go. So this is the end result. You guys can see how easy it is. I did not. The only tool I really needed was my razor cutter. I really like this because um, it's really easy to control, especially if it's like new and sharp. It's really easy to control. You're not going to cut your scalp. I just pulled and well, you guys saw how I did it. So, and secondly, any type of adhesive that agrees with your skin. So I really like using spritz or a really strong hairspray like uh, the got to be and i find it's very clean you guys can see it's not sticky it's not gummy or anything like that sometimes i find with the gel um it can get a little bit messy if you're heavy-handed you don't need a lot and yeah so tell me what you guys think about the process about the hairstyle my makeup um anything um yeah so i will see you guys in the next video thank you guys for watching if you guys have any um requests please leave